I'm Erin Conrad from Two Works For You. Here are today's top stories. We're expecting to learn more about possible mass graves from the 1921 Tulsa race massacre this evening. Scientists plan to reveal what they found in their search back in October. These results will help them decide whether to move ahead to the next phase of that investigation. And we are now learning new information about a murder-suicide in Jinx that left a father and his two sons dead. It happened Saturday night at the Country Woods Edition near West 106th Street South. South. Officers say Tang Ken took his four children into the garage, then shot and killed his eight and ten year old sons before then shooting himself. The two other children were not hurt. Well, freezing rain and patchy ice all across the metro area causing several wrecks this morning. The BA going westbound into the IDL was a big trouble spot for a lot of drivers who lost control of their cars and caused some major accidents there. Two lanes into the IDL were blocked for at least 40 minutes while the fire department and officials worked at least three different wrecks there. Now let's get a check of that forecast with meteorologist Clint Boone. Thank you very much, Erin. Looks like a better drive home from work today. It's going to be cold and blustery. Temperatures this afternoon, only the upper 20s. Can't even rule out a few flurries out there, but not expecting any accumulation. Tonight, clearing, very chilly tomorrow morning, 22, 46 for a high tomorrow afternoon. Nice warm up the rest of the week in the 50s and even some 60s Sunday, heading through Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. Aaron. All right, thanks, Clint. That was a look at our digital update. Keep checking back for updates all throughout the day. I'm Erin Conrad. Two works for you.